Well, g'day, I'm Simon from the Lifestyle Pioneers and we're down here at the brand new Titanium deal. How are you, hey, mate? mate? How are you? If you don't know, Jason is the man behind Titanium Caravans and they've opened this awesome new showroom dealership here in Epping in Victoria. So let's go and have a walk around, see some of the new stuff let's you guys have got. Guys. You've been busy, eh? Hey? Flat out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they've got some awesome new gear here, some cool cars on display and yeah, a heap of new vans. So let's go for a bit of a wander and check it out. A really good turnout here today. Good to see so many families here as well. Method are here with their race car, so they've got their, their race car on display. Awesome bit of gear that is as well. Heap of new vans here, they've got a family vans here as well as obviously a couple's vans and that as well. And a lot of new ideas that Titanium are bringing to the industry. So a lot of new um, aluminium stuff that they're bringing in from the aluminium fabrication business that they're partnered with, uh, with Wolf Fabrication. So new toolbox designs, new cappings on the outside, new hatches, um, a lot of new really cool ideas and a lot of firsts for the industry. But let's go inside because there's some even better stuff inside. Let's go and check it out. Aussie Destinations Unknown are here as well. They've just picked up their brand new caravan. They've got their big Chevy rig on display here as well. Here's Jason again. Here we are. <laughs> he finally caught back up with us. You got off the phone, mate. Oh, well, yeah, mate. <laughs> it's all happening. It's flat out. Mate, how awesome is all this new gear you guys are bringing to the market? You guys have been busy, it's busy. Very busy. It's taken yeah, a lot of time, a lot of R&D, a lot of running around yesterday getting it all fitted to the vans. Yes. And yeah, we're just really excited to show it all and um, yeah, get it out to the market and start using it. Can't wait. How many more things that you guys got in the pipeline because you are just pushing and pushing and pushing this yeah so the, the next thing that you'll see come through the pipeline will be the uh the picnic tables on the outside of the van that are also massive pantries yeah wow. Well. more outdoor storage for your cooking and then yeah that's going to roll out and we can't wait bigger outdoor kitchens coming as well so just yeah starting to really capitalize on that outside cooking awesome yeah. and there's obviously a lot of advantages to all of this aluminium that you guys are using for your hatches now yes. you're doing your own cappings yes obviously looks really good but also it gives you guys more control over your production it does we're in control we control the quality everything's made here in australia with australian products yeah That's it. And, it, and it looks wicked yeah it does which is important and it seals a lot better the coverage is nearly triple yeah that nice helps too yeah it help, helps with the bonding and keep it, really it all does, sealed yeah. out awesome awesome yeah i'm gonna keep moving we're gonna go and see the virtual uh, showroom oh, in, yeah fun. so what they've been able to do in here this is again something i've never seen in the caravan industry before but where they can project a floor plan of your caravan uh, onto the floor in life size so it's two scale uh, you can you can make changes to the layout and see the different layouts and how that's gonna uh, look when it's in when your van's built and it just helps people to visualize a lot better what space that they've got that they're dealing with It'll help you choose what size van's gonna suit you and what layout's gonna suit your needs Okay, so once you've picked out your model and your layout that you're going to go with from the showroom outside, you're going to make your way inside here and then the fun begins. You get to start picking out the colours and, the, and everything in your van as well. So come inside here and we'll head upstairs uh, and go and check out how they're going to be doing that at the new showroom here. Nice photos on the wall too, some, some people on the wall there. Good looking, good looking family that one. Okay, so picking out all the colours and the finishes inside your van can be one of the most daunting parts of the whole process, but Titanium have come up with this new idea to make that as simple and as stress-free as possible. They've got all laid out across the wall here, all your different finishes, your different upholstery, your interior cabinetry colours, all of that laid out there so you can pick it all out and have it laid out nicely. And then sitting down here with your consultant, you can pick, they can pull them up on the screen and show you what it's going to look like in real life. So a really nice way to be able to pick out all those colours and take a lot of the guesswork out what's going to look good and what's going to be the end of your van is going to look like when you come to pick it up. All right, let's go through and have a look at a couple of the models they've got on display here and I'll show you some of these new ideas that they've been bringing to the market which we were just talking about before. All right, so this is one of the new caravans the guys are just, uh, this one's just literally come out of the factory in the last couple of days. But this is some of the new ideas that they're bringing out is this aluminium capping on the side of the vans. Instead of using traditional J-moulding, um, this is one of the new things that we were just talking with Jason about. So it gives them better sealing. It looks really cool. It looks really tough. I love it. Uh, and these laser engraved logos and things like that looks really good. So these are new aluminium hatches as well as one of the things that the Titanium's been uh, testing out and bringing to the market. So again, it gives them more flexibility over design over the sizing and things as well as having control over that production line so that's really cool to see something else they're testing out is this new textured paint which is looking really good too on the side of the vans i'm loving the look of that so by putting the electrical system behind the fridge here it just gives a lot more flexibility in the design it takes your charging gear out from under your bed or your couch and frees up that storage space and uses up what is otherwise dead space behind the fridge and the way the guys have designed it with the ventilation and everything actually gives the charging gear a lot better ventilation because keeping your gear cool 
cooler means that the charging gear works better. And then right up the back here, the, these awesome rear bars that the guys have come up with. Again, just looks really cool, but is very practical. You've got storage drawer in here for storing all your hoses and things like that. You've got your firewood rack. You can also do twin spares if you want, but your firewood rack, rack there, and I use that with our caravan for taking rubbish back out of your campsite as well. Really handy for that. And just tidies up the van and finishes it off really nicely. And then that coupled with the rear roof spoiler as well, uh, which again, just sets off the vans perfectly. So something very new for titanium, to do this smaller van on a single axle, uh, just that lighter towing weight for those that don't want to tow with a big vehicle or tow a big heavy van, just gives it a lot more flexibility. Um, let's jump inside and have a look. These are really cool inside. So as you can see, everything you need in here, nothing you don't. You've still got your full ensuite, your kitchen, your dining area, and your bed up the front, obviously. Plenty of space if there's just two people. They do do a, they can do these in a family layout as well with bunks, uh, but you do lose your dining area. So it's more designed around outdoor living and spending time outside, and then just the basics that you need inside. But like I said, a much smaller van to tow around. It opens up a bigger variety of towing vehicles you can use, and yeah, it just works really, really well. So really cool to see titanium uh, um, testing out some new ideas and some new concepts. So something else that they've just released is this new toolbox design. These come in a variety of configurations, but a completely uh, new concept and it incorporates your ca uh, gas bottle storage at the front, as well as some storage for your hoses and dirty gear and things like that. This one in particular has been spec to have bike storage in there as well. So you got your, this one's got two e-bikes in there. So two full-size bikes uh, on the slide. So this is actually Chris and Miriam's van from Aussie Destinations Unknown. Uh, and this is obviously what they're really into is their mountain biking. So a really good way to be able to store bikes, especially expensive bikes like these ones, keeping them out of the sun, out of the dust and out of prying eyes. So a really great idea. But you can spec this if you don't want to carry bikes. They do do it with a, a barbecue slide and a different storage options as well. But again, just good to see some innovation and some new design in the caravan space. Well, let's go for a bit of a walk around and see if we can find some other familiar faces around here and have a bit of a chat. Jeremy Cameron, titanium owner now, mate. Yes, yeah, only recently too, so absolutely loving it. We um, we had a week in Bright, and that's the first time we got it out of our property, so I've pretty much been living in it oh, you're on living our in? own property. Yeah, perfect. Does that make sense? Yeah, so yeah. We just sort of canned the house because we got the van now, so we nice. live in, in the back paddock, but yeah. How, how good are the vans? Unreal, mate, unreal. Is it your first van? Yes, yeah, so it is. Um, I sort of, speaking to Jason and a few of the other guys, I sort of, I thought it was more after a retire yeah, sort of yeah. situation. And now that I've got one, I wish it was like 10 years ago yeah. I made that decision. Yeah, it's all that. I've always grown up in swags and tents and mum and dad always had a van, so we're always um, out traveling and, and whatnot. But for the last sort of 10 years in footy, I haven't done too much. So it's nice to finally have one. You're probably like me, mate. You're probably out there camping, looking at people in caravans going, what, as if you'd need that. Yeah, like it's yeah. over the top, you yeah. don't need it all. And then you get one exactly. and like you say, you're like, I should have done this a long time yeah, ago. Yeah, yeah, that's the first It thing makes I it easy yeah. and simple and, and everything's there. And every, nah, it's all part of it. Good so to see you, mate. No worries at Thanks all. Thanks for having a chat. We're going to jump in another van and yeah. see. And then grab a feed. Yeah, grab I just had a sausage. Yeah. <laughs> I was looking for Chris and Miriam, but I don't know where they are. Chris, mate. I'm Chris, mate. How are you, bro? Good way. Well, these guys need no introduction if you've been in the Titanium family for a while, these guys. Yeah. Uh, Chris, Miriam, Aussie Destination Unknown, just picked up their new Titanium. It's Titanium number... Three. Three. I'm, I'm like, there's three. Yeah, three. Some new ideas, some new... What have you changed? Oh, mate. How much have we changed in this van? The new front box is cool. We had a look new at that front already. New box, new bike box. Absolutely incredible. Yeah. Huge power system. We've got 900 amps. Twin inverters. 1.7 kilowatt twin inverters, so 5,600 watts. Wow. Incredible. That's a big game changer for us. And you guys are going gas free again? You're sticking with gas, gas free? Gas free, yeah, yep. 100%. Diesel hot water, diesel heating inside. Yep. And then everything else is full electric, so. Way yeah. to go, eh? Unbelievable. Same as what we did with our van. Yep. And you, you can't go back. Look, no, you'll never go back. No. Yeah, it's unreal. Yeah, Simplify you, things and just. Yeah. 100%. Yeah. If you yeah. ever try cooking with gas when there's wind, you Come start, more. hey, you start eating grass by the end of the day. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but you like your lettuce, right? You like yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> love it. I love it. You know, Corian bean yeah. shops. Like, oh, true. Like, yeah. Oh, this thing gets beautiful. Where are you off to? Stunning. Where's the first place you're heading? 
Back to Queensland. Queensland. Quickly, go back, see the kids. Back to the warm. Back to the warm. And then yep. down to Tassie. Oh, and then you're back and again. Back to Tassie, and then back up to Arnhem Land. And you're like us. Yeah, I know. All over the place. We're going around Australia like that. Someone messaged us the other day and said you should rename yourselves the Yo-Yo Travellers. Because <laughs> you just go up and down That's and up and down. That's a good name, I like that one. <laughs> the Yo-Yo Travellers. Yeah. Yeah. off. Yeah. Yep. A new car coming soon as well? New truck coming soon, can't say too much. But no, no. But yeah. just build the, build the excitement. Yeah. 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 Put the 2024 model HD Chevy coming up, so interior excited, super excited. Yeah, yeah. that's awesome. Love it, love yeah. it. And big day, yeah, good turnout, eh? Today, massive day. It's been huge. Yeah, we still got our voices. I was just gonna say, the voices. Oh, God, yeah. Our new caravan is worn out already. Yeah. Because there's been yeah. so many people walking through it. So yeah. We're excited. Everyone loves yeah. it. Yeah, it's oh, good. It's been amazing. Unreal. Yeah. Yep. Henry and Sarah, otherwise known as Living Off the Van. You guys have got your new Titanium a couple of months ago. Yeah, we did. Yeah. yeah. As yeah. Stoked with it. And it's second van, third van. How many vans have you had? Second. This is our second van. First van we've built. So. Yeah, right. First yeah. new one. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so, what, what better way to do it with, than with the group of Titanium. So. And how cool is the new centre they've built oh, here as well? This is awesome. Yeah. This is exactly what they need to display these amazing things, I suppose. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Give, give people the opportunity to come and have a really good look and, and see what, what the future holds for Titanium. And, yeah. So where are you guys off to next? Where's your first trip? Um, yeah, it's in O. We were gonna probably chase warm weather, but it's here at the moment. So. It's not. It's not a bad day, eh? I was. I. I brought a lot of jumpers and jackets that I'm yeah. not gonna need. Yeah. Yeah. We, we'd love to go north, but I think it's the wrong time of the year now, so it's too hot. Um, we'll probably hang down here for a bit, and then I don't know somewhere around May, June, head off again and yep. north. And Might sneak Tassie in, maybe. Yeah, we'll see how we go. And you guys live in the van? Yeah, full time. Full time. Yep. Well there you have it guys, this is the brand new showroom as we said down here in Epping, it's at 595 Edgars Road uh, in Epping, Victoria. A heap of new models here on display as well as that awesome interactive space where you can come and make your selections and have a look at all the entire range of titanium caravans. Uh, I hope you enjoyed having a quick look around and we'll see you guys next time. Cheers.